Greetings and salutations, everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Thief 2X, Shadows of the Middle Age. I'm Kamchak Fisco. Come join me for a sneaksy adventure. I sense thee come out. Can I get his key before I hit him? Perhaps I've been hasty. That may have been a mistake. Yeah, don't kill the hammer. So we're allowed to knock them out. They're allowed to see each other. There's two of them. Come on, boys. Over here. Over here. Shit, shit, shit. Alright. Back to where we were here. Let's get him to actually come into the shadows so we can club him as opposed to before where he walked off. Come out. Come on, buddy. Give me the key. You park your happy little ass down there. Okay, we got another one. And the fourth one, so. Oh good, it's right here. Okay, that makes it easier. Okay. These guys are down, now we can actually explore some without worrying about triggering anybody. Um, grab the guy, thank you. I'm gonna move the guy from the stairwell, because that's probably not a good place to leave him. Because if anybody goes up or down that stairs, we're in trouble. So, let's go snag the body. chapel that goes, I'm guessing, to the front of the place. We've got a downstairs. We've got this whole area over here. That way. The door we can't open, which we should be able to now that we have the key. So I need to actually test that. Does the key work on that door? Inner chapel key. Why, yes it does. Perfect. Okay, what do we have? What is of interest in the cathedral? Oh, the fact that our sword is more like a scimitar as opposed to the old... What was it? Short sword? Long sword? Whatever it was in the original Thief? I think it was a short sword, actually. No holy water. That's technically a good thing, because if we need holy water on this level, that means we're gonna run into the undead nasties. I'd rather not, unless I have to. Okay. Got a door behind us. That goes to loot, so I'll go ahead and grab that first. 115. There's people above us. So I probably should go check that out. If they're right above the cathedral. The cathedral. The whole thing's a cathedral. Above the chapel. Keep saying the wrong words. We know English. There we go. Strong is the hammer wielded in solitude. Stronger yet the hammer raised and struck for a righteous cause. Of the hammer, verse one. Right. Crazy nut bags. At least they are crazy nut bags with wealth. There he is. I knew I heard this person in the background when we were wandering. Good night, sir. Build a guide thing. Let's take you out of the patrol route. Go dump you over here in a corner where nobody's likely to run into you. 
Let's check this other side. Hundred and forty. Nothing over here. In the builder's name! Nope, sorry. <laughs> Got a little carried away with the ambiance. 150. Shit's not really worth that much. I think it'd be worth more considering how um the hammers are. Now to get back downstairs. We've got that area underneath and the area back where we first came from. So we should probably go check those out. Although I didn't need to stop and read the book that was on the uh, chapel table over here. I'm sure it's some ridiculous sermon, but hey, let's check it out. And the night woman said, Give, th give of yourself unto me. Oh, probably do it in a woman's voice. Give of yourself unto me. Tell none, and you shall yet receive those blessings which are yours. And so the Aaron Hammer did lay with her, and told not his brothers, and told not his acolytes, and told not his superiors. And yet the night woman did brag and swing her arrogance like a club, to tell others of a grand catch, a hammer who did lay aside his vows. And for her arrogance and his folly, a mob did strike them down, righteous and commanding, and the builder was pleased. The fifth book of wrath, verse 7. Yeah. Crazy! Hmm. What was that? Nothing. Back here. So we got those two over there. It's probably a convo when we get close enough. Let me go stash this dude over here in a corner. So this leads to branching parts of the building. There's just no real place to stash him. I'll drag him back into the building with me, put him in the closet. So let's go check out the downstairs before we go wandering around the rest of the facility. La da 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 dee. Let's go check that way before we go downstairs. It's, it should lead right into that other building. I don't know where we saw. To whom it may concern, I am greatly dismayed at the growing lack of hammer security at Silver Street Carriage House. I have seen shady characters lurking about with increasing frequency. Just yesterday I confronted one of them myself and inquired as to his business here in Sunnyport. He simply sneered at me and suggested that I perform certain activities with myself that I assure you are anatomically impossible. Until you investigate these individuals further, you will not be receiving any substantial money donation from to your order. I may be reached during business hours at the Foaming Dog Grill. Good day, Mr. Kelto Talls. Hmm. People unhappy with what the hammers are doing. Shock and surprise. What the hell? But I don't normally allow anyone in my kitchen. <laughs> Since when is the galley such a secret? Tis not as if thou art cooking up poisons and potions. Of course not. Why would I ever want to poison anyone? It's just that many of my dishes are sensitive. I must remain focused on my creations. Sensitive? Why, just last week I did use your mutton loaf to pry the lid from a clogged sewage tunnel. <coughs> Brother Derek is said to be using yesterday's butter roll as a doorstop in his quarters. <laughs> the rats are demanding compensation. For removing the wretched scraps from the Builder's House of Worship. I've, I've been distracted by personal problems. Not to worry, friend. The dangers I face at thy table serve only to strengthen my faith in the healing mercies of the Builder. Uh, what a douche. Sweep the floor. Don't forget to put the broom back. <gasps> Sorry, bro. Trust me, I'm with you in this particular argument. He's definitely a mega douche. Cool fire arrow. Sweet. Gotta stash him in a better corner. There we go. Got a little snack. Hammers won't mind if I eat their supplies. After all, they said the food was horrible. Why would they mind? Anything up there? Hmm, nothing we can grab. So, let's read the book. Lazy is the farmer who tends not his crop. Unrighteous is the acolyte who tends not his tools. Service of the Brotherhood. Mm -hmm. Those wacky hammers. 
Don't mind me, I'm just gonna eat all of your food while I'm in the neighborhood. Nope, no water, I'm just checking. Let's see where the hammer went. Hmm, I don't see him, he must have gone through one of the doors. So, we need to see if there's anything of value to grab. Hammers, you shouldn't have golden... Uh, goblets, that's the word. I couldn't think of the word. Man, the music's loud in here. I'll just leave that open for now. Hook back around the long way once we're done. Mess hall. Gill in-house chef. Oh, really? Let's see what the chef is up to. Wasn't the chef the guy we just clubbed on con- Yeah, he was. Okay. Ooh. Gil, tomorrow's soup will be just fine. Make sure not to overdo it. The chemical I've given you is extremely potent and will take effect within the day if mixed properly. As promised, you'll receive a handsome pay, pay raise and a promotion as well. Once I've taken care of Bishop Cavador's place, once I've taken Bishop Cavador's place, only keep silent until the excitement of the next few days has died down. Own him. I guess I'm not the only one sneaking around in this place. Yeah. The chef is, in fact poisoning the food, only it's not poison, it just sounds like a tranquilizer or something. Hmm. About it's a loud music area. Okay, even if I take the torches out, there's still the, the light right overhead, so... That's not gonna help. Training hall. Go ahead and shut the door so we have some sound buffer between us and the hammer. Hello! <coughs> Good night. My, may thy dreams be filled with the righteous judgment of the builder! Because <coughs> it sure as hell won't be in the waking world! Ha <laughs> ha! Okay, what do we got here? We're in a training room. Aren't there like arrows or something we could loot? There's got to be something of value in here. Arrows, something. Ah, sorry, <laughs> my thumb twitch. Yep, there we go. Arrows. I figured there had to be weapons in here. It's a training room for crying out loud. So what is this? Baptismal pool. That's what it looks like. Any water arrows in here? Yay, water <laughs> Okay. Yep, this is the baptismal font, I'm guessing. A little tree. Oh, okay. I was just wondering, maybe there might be a water arrow or something stashed in one of these. You never know. Hello? Nope, nothing. Okay, just checking. Dormitories. Anybody in the dormitories? Money. More money. And a bedroll! That doesn't help. Looks like the locker room. Quartermaster Samuel. Samuel, excuse me. Okay, so this is like the the lockers in two when we were uh, boarding the ship. Healing potion, rosary beads. Never know when rosary beads might come in handy. We'll take those with us. Hello. There we go. Wouldn't let me grab the bag. That was a little weird. Got another EMP mine. Always a good thing. Okay, so that should be everything. Now it's just a matter of opening this puppy. Um, hello. I'm like right on top of it. Nope. Wrong way. Here we go. Okay. Another rope barrel. Let's see if we need those. Okay, so. And clicky 
chodí. I remain strong. My sturdy hammer companions would not dare to complain or grumble at the, the stomach of flu, so neither shall I. I was able to keep down a small bit of water today, the first time all day. I can't imagine where I'd have contracted such a terrible sickness. Oh, this is the, 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 the bishop. Perhaps tis only the winter weather. I shall sleep for a while. If the illness has not subsided, I will shamefully appeal for help into the town. Into town for the hand of a healer, but for now, I must rest. Well, that meal certainly didn't agree with him. It killed him. I would say it didn't agree with them. Holy hell. Okay. More money. More monies. Always with the monies. Evil hammers. Oh dear. I gotta sneeze, please. One sec, guys. Ow! That hurt. I'm okay. It's only my brains that sneezed out. We're fine. Okay. So, there's the hammer I keep hearing. Let's see if this wraps around, though. There's two more right there. What the hell? This place just goes on and on. Oh, what's this? Dear Solon, if you do nothing else, please, oh please, reconsider joining the Hammers. We have, the, we have been friends since childhood, and I cannot bear the thought of you in such a dank, foreboding place. Who knows what terrible rigors you shall be forced to endure? Who can say what horrific and degrading tests you shall encounter? You shall live a strict life, one devoid of gentle pleasures. One devoid of the gentle pleasures of life. But the truth of the matter is that I love you, Soren. I wish I had told you this before you left, but I was frightened and cowardly. Now, perhaps it is too late, and you may have already given your vows to their cause. Please, I beg of you, even if you wish never to again to lay eyes upon me, leave the Hammerites. I hold such a fear that they shall destroy you in that which I hold most dear. With all my love, Celesta. P.S. I have informed my family I shall not marry Count Doroth under any circumstance. I do not love that man, nor he I. Fortunately, my refusal did not upset him. Mm-hmm. Obviously, he didn't leave the order. Mom and Dad from Brayson. You were very wrong about the hammers. In my few short weeks here at Sunnyport, I've already begun to realize how heretical the mechanists are. Many of the acolytes here have similar feelings. The hammer is the only true tool of the builder, and we shall soon prove it. Oh, don't worry, it'll work itself out. Several of us have been assigned to recover an old artifact of the mausoleum tomorrow. The older brother seems to shake the older brothers seem to shake at the mere mention of the place. But we were not afraid. I shall write again when I return, and with a great story of adventure which will restore your faith in the order. Love Brayson. I don't think it's gonna go well. If the older hammers fear it, there's a frickin' reason for it, dude. That's metal, so we're gonna need to like mossify it to get in there. Halt! Why dost thou wear the garment of the mainland order? Dost thou insult thy brethren by forsaking our sacred dress? Uh, yes, dear uh, brother. Elder, uh, sir, uh, I've just arrived from uh, the city, sir, and uh, the quartermaster has taken ill, and I, uh, um... Cease thy ramblings at once, and stand straight. The builder's vessels must remain vigilant, ready both in season and out. Thy reckless disregard for thine appearance should be requited on the rack. Yes, sir, I mean, uh, I mean, no, sir, it's just that the order seems very different here in Sunnyport, and I, I, I haven't quite yet settled in, sir. The order? Tis the same, young convert. Tis the outward appearance which seemest different to thine eye. There art many ways to express the builder's will, some by the hammer, others by the machine. When thou hast dwelt in our midst for the duration, thou shalt learn to judge with right judgment. Yes, sir, brother. Uh, uh, sir. Mm -hmm. Let's get back over to here so we can ambush them when one of them goes by. If one of them goes by. Or not. I think I want to go this way and come back around because it was a more angled approach. That should help. Oh, good. We can take one of them out now. That'll be one of the three patrollers. Hoping there's not more. 
I don't know how I missed, but okay. Bill to guide thee in thy dreams of slumber. <clears throat> Thanks for tuning in, you all are awesome viewers. I really appreciate you taking the time to watch my videos. It means a lot to me and I do hope you enjoyed them. You all take care of yourselves and if you want to see more of me, go up the video on the list or stay tuned for more. Feel free to leave a comment below and please remember to tag that like button if you enjoyed the video. In the meantime, fare thee well everyone.